Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and happy Wish Wednesday! All right, if you're new here, my name is Claire, and this channel is all about mom stuff, lady stuff, and life stuff. And every single Wednesday, I do a review of a product I got on Wish.com. So I will leave a link down below of a playlist that has all of my Wish adventures because there's a lot of random cool stuff in there. So definitely check it out. And today, I am back in the kitchen from Wish, and I am testing out this microwave cleaner. So, this is what it looks like. This actually only cost $4, so pretty decent. And it doesn't have any directions with it because, you know, that happens when you order from Wish. But on the page on Wish.com where I bought it, um, there's a couple pictures and one of them showed you how to use it. So I just had to go back onto Wish and look at that. And basically, you... Okay. So her little hair pops off and her head. <laughs> it's just this empty container and then the the lid or her adorable red hair has little holes on it and you're supposed to put water and vinegar inside here and close it and then microwave it for an unknown amount of time. So I guess we'll try that. And steam is supposed to shoot out of her head and then making it very easy for you to clean up anything in your microwave that's real sticky or stuck on there. So, lucky for us, last night I microwaved a bunch of barbecue sauce into my microwave just to test this out. So, we'll see how it works. Okay, actually I've noticed on the back here, there's a line right here that says vinegar and then a line up here that says water. So I'm gonna pour the vinegar Putting her little hair back on. Don't want her to be bald while she cleans the microwave. All right, you guys, like I said, worked on a little barbecue sauce for you there earlier, so it's actually not that dirty. I mean, you might think it is, but there's a little bit of, little bit of streakage on the door and, you know, that beautiful thing. So I don't know how long this will take. Just going to set her on in there. I don't know. Let's start at a minute and see how it goes. Okay, so we're about a minute in and I thought maybe I'll go back to Wish and look up the description and maybe there'll be better directions there. And there was. It said uh, five to seven minutes or five to eight minutes and it should start spewing steam at around two minutes. So I reset my uh, my timer there and any moment she should be ready to blow. I think it's bubbling in there guys. All right you guys, she's been in there for about four minutes and there's yet to be any sort of visible like steam coming out of her head. There's some water droplets kind of coming out for sure and I can smell the vinegar like totally but it's not like the picture at all where there's like steam spewing from her head. So I guess we'll do the full eight minutes and we'll see. All right, so it's been a full eight minutes. Let's see what's going on in here. I mean, I was really expecting there to be like a coating of mist all over everything, but you know, there's not. So I'm pretty sure I just baked that barbecue sauce on there for an additional eight minutes. So that's great. Uh, let's see how she did. Um, all right. She's, she's pretty hot. Um, I do want to look inside and see like how much water is in there. Now this is where it gets a little bit curious guys. There's nothing left in there. So it did work even though I couldn't see the steam. Maybe I'm just judging her all wrong. There's only one way to find out. Alright so you know I gotta go for that barbecue sauce first. Okay. 
Oh, you know what? That's not bad. I mean, it was pretty, it was pretty sticky and stuck on there. But, I mean, I'm going to have to go in with some spray cleaner and get that. I mean, it's not... I mean, all this crust, I mean, it's not going anywhere. Turn table that around. That's also barbecue sauce. Oh. Nope. Nope, it didn't work, you guys. All right, you guys, so this little gadget is going to be a wish fail today. It was kind of sad because it seemed like it seemed like it would work. I mean, I've seen on other people's channels and on Pinterest that you like put a bowl, like just a regular bowl of water and vinegar or like water and lemon juice and microwave it and like that works. So like why didn't this work? And even more interesting, she was completely empty at the end of it, which means the water did go places. So why didn't it work? I don't know. I don't know if anybody knows like the science behind where the water went please tell me in the comments below because I don't know and it's weird so in conclusion save your four dollars just use like some spray cleaner and a cloth and that's probably just fine in your microwave so that's another wish Wednesday in the books definitely hit that subscribe button because I will be back next Wednesday with another interesting wish item and of course make sure you check out all of my other wish videos you'll definitely find a few wish wins in there as well so definitely take a look there and come back for more mom stuff lady stuff and life stuff new videos every Wednesday obviously but also every Friday and Sunday and I'll see you guys in my next one keep wishing my friends bye